All right, we've done all the secondary objectives. Let's focus on the main ones. Rescue the Allied soldiers, call the Green Beret, and open the hangar door. All right, rescue the Allied soldiers. They are down here. Deep inside this building. So what we need to do is get to this door. The problem being, this guy is watching. No, and this guy, he can identify us if we get into the light green area. So we're going to have to stick... To the dark green zones and time our movements okay so that we go to that door when he yes right now come on actually perfect <laughs> it's as if he knew when i was arriving all right now nobody can identify as the thing uh -huh. let's just go straight down All right, let's see what's the situation like here. One guy who is looking at, well, exactly nothing. Interesting. Oui, monsieur. You know what? I could just go ahead and uh, bring in Green Berry as well. He might make this a part of the mission a bit easier. I can do it without him. That's going to be a bit tricky. Going there. I might just show you guys how I can do this without the, the uh, green bearer anyway, just, you know, to flex a bit. <laughs> but uh, since we're close by, and I don't think there's any officer here, there's a lot of soldiers, but not a single officer. I think we can just uh, waltz inside this building and call the green bearer. We. Oui. I know officers here either. Is there any useful equipment though? Hold on. We should be checking for equipment because we're gonna need explosives in this mission. I know that for a fact. Let's first contact the Green Berry. You took your time. Tell me where to land. That's action. I want some of it. Alright, so now what has changed is uh, there has a little parachute arrow uh, icon appeared here. And we can click that and uh, tell Green Berry where to land. We can choose his landing spot. We oui, miss you. Gonna have to be careful with that though. Before we go, let me quickly oui. check. I think this crate contains something valuable. Let's see if I remember correctly. Yes, wow. A lot of things. All right, let's take all of them. We need as many bombs as we can, especially the blue ones. These are less, uh, these are bombs on a timer and these are remotely detonated bombs. So these are very valuable. You can detonate them all at once, while this one is kind of used for the easiest objective, usually. Maybe. Alright, now. <laughs> I think I have a good landing spot for the green berry. It is okay. quite tricky, but I think if you have a bit of luck and time it correctly, he can land on this side. Nobody can see him here. So let me see if I can actually do this right now. Let's quick save. Have him land over here. Will anybody see him? Wow, nailed it. <laughs> no. Finished. Get up, man. <laughs> that is interesting. You should not do suspicious things with a spy. I wanted to actually crouch with a green berry only. Yeah. Well, it looks like a good spot to save now that we actually managed to successfully bring in a green berry. All right. So now we're going to do the same thing. I'm going to wait for this officer to actually stop looking and then head in as soon as he does. In the store, I mean. It does take his time. <laughs> Come on, Mr. Officer. You gotta be patient in this game. Like, really patient sometimes. There you go. That's our opportunity. Come on. Wow, he moves slow. <laughs> I, no, I don't think these guys can see me. Leave it to me. 
They might see me for a split second, maybe. Let's see. Did he actually see me? Will he follow me? Interesting. Alright, let's see now what the situation is. We have actually a guy right next to us. <laughs> totally unaware that he's about to uh, to get hammered. Give me the knife. Leave it to me. All right, I don't think anybody can see him here, but just in case, let's put him right in the in the corner, just That's to be it. on the safe side. And obviously now let's yes. bring down the German as well. Where did I leave the German? Oh, he's over there. Okay, cool. <laughs> and just enter through this door, I guess. All right, now, oui. as I said, I could do this very stealthily, but okay, just for the heck of it, let's uh, start eliminating people. Mm. Now, I'm going to direct this guy to go here. Uh -huh. my I don't think anybody can uh, see him there. Yeah. I might be wrong, but let's see. Uh -huh. And he's going to stay there for as long as I want. Okay. Which is very powerful, actually. <laughs> Alright, good hiding spot as well. So I might just leave him there. Can anybody see this guy over here? Maybe this guy turns around, we'll see. Yeah. Let's just dispose of everybody in this area. Because there's gonna be a lot of alarms <laughs> going on at some point. Now let's direct this guy. Over there, maybe. Oui, c'est mal dort. Huh? Excellent. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> Man, the sound effects always gets me. These old school games, they kind of went overboard with sound effects a lot of the time. Go your way, sir. I kind of miss that. I have to say. Very distinct of uh, of that 90s era of games. All right, now, hold on. I think we still need to take care of uh, other guys in the area. So there's a guy here, one guy up there. He should be easy. I don't think anybody's looking behind him. Should be pretty far away from the action. Yes. So let's go with the spy once again. You're going to see a pattern here. We. Oui. Oui. And I think that's actually how most uh, commandos players play. Like they find something that they like. <laughs> a simple tactic, usually involving uh, two members, no more. And they just stick to it until the end. It's kind of fun to see Going there. how much you can get done with only one tactic. But to be honest, I've played this time this uh, game so many times that I've uh, <laughs> sometimes I'm kind of growing bored and I'm trying new things just for the heck of it. Uh -huh. And I think nobody can actually see me, even if I run here. Uh -huh. Let's see. Just careful for this guy not to listen to us, so do not run. Moin. Will he hear if I kill him? No, he doesn't. Excellent. Let's just stash him over here, maybe. Just a bit further away. It's done. I'm gonna get his gun, even though I'm not gonna use it, but just in case. And now this guy, this guy doesn't even need... Oh, hold on. See? I ran there, and this guy turned around. Uh -huh. So you gotta be careful. You gotta be patient. Okay. Now I can run. Aha. Uh -huh. Now, uh, see? Uh -huh. Not even needing a distraction. Some guys are very easy. Now, I'm gonna stash him with the other body. Although, before we do that, I could actually get his guns. This is mine. Or just the bullets, maybe. Excellent. Looks like a good spot, too. Make a hard save as well.
All right, now. Now let's focus on the actual uh, mission. We have to free the prisoners that are inside this area, this cell. Let's go do that first. Right away, sir. You do not need to uh, escort them outside to complete that objective, but we're gonna need to do that later on. For the time being, we just need to untie them. All right, nobody can see me around here, right? We. Oui. Let's just do that. Okay. It is interesting that uh, he doesn't do any sound with his footsteps. Uh -huh. We looted the key already. So now we can just go in and start waking our comrades up. We. Oui. Oh, thank you. We were thinking you'd given up the search. We have to rescue our captain. Damn Nazis! Let's destroy the hangar while he fixed their torpedoes. This'll disable them for a while. Alright, so the rescue became a bit more complicated. We need to save the captain as well. All mine. Let's start waking up everybody else. You do not need to wake everybody up because as soon as you wake one or two, they're gonna start doing it themselves. Like they can start waking each other up. That is considered advanced AI for that era, <laughs> by the way. I think we already got the check mark. Let's see. Rescue the Allied soldiers, yes. Open the hangar door. And rescue the captain. It's actually those two are gonna happen in the same location. We have to enter this building and inside that building there's a switch and there's also the captain being held captive. Now I'm gonna leave the sailors in for now. Hold on though, I think. Can anybody see here? We. Oui. Alright, let's actually... What does this guy see? Yeah, that, that guy can see a bit. I'm ready. Maybe I should just quickly stash the bodies up here with the green berry. Because I'm going to direct that guy towards this, uh, this area and I do not want him to spot the bodies and sound the alarm. So let's just make sure everything is nice and tidy before we do anything. Okay, that should be enough. It's done. Now let's take the German, give some orders. Son, would you please go look over there? Yeah. Can I tell him to go yes. further away? Yes, I can. It's a bit... That is not helpful, so I'm going to direct him a bit towards here. Now he's facing the right direction. Yeah. Can go in and kill him. Okay. And I don't think that guy can see him anymore. Just save uh -huh. to be on the safe side. <laughs> Excellent. Another one bites the dust. Now I'm going to leave this guy here. Let's not go all the way back. I don't think that's necessary anyway. We're gonna have to dispose of these guys. What does this guy look? Let's see. Oh, he doesn't actually look at anybody. That's very helpful. That guy is more annoying than anybody else. All right, let's see. That is interesting. How are we gonna do this? Does this guy go first? If I distract this German. I'm more worried about this guy up here. Yeah, see, he sees kind of everything, but he doesn't see him right there, which is very interesting. It might just work. Yeah. Right, let's bring in the German and see. At your service. Is anybody looking at this guy, actually? Nobody's looking at him. It's very interesting. 
could just go in and kill him first. At your service. Should Let's try that. At your service. Mm. 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 All right, and now it's the green bear's job to do the rest. Okay. Did he see me? He almost saw me. Aha. <laughs> uh -huh. A bit overzealous there. Aha. Uh -huh. <sighs> Done. No, I don't think anybody can see him here, actually. So I might just leave him there. Although, hold on. No, as soon as I release this guy, he's gonna see him, so... Let's maybe find a better hiding spot, unless... Unless I can kill this guy as well, in one fell swoop. Yeah, I might be able to do this. Just knife him. Uh -huh. Like, exactly where he stands. The green bear does not need to get up to knife somebody. Go. That's the trick here. So he's not gonna see me, see? I can just do this from my uh, lying down on the ground. Oh, that guy heard it though. Interesting. See how my camera on now. Oh, damn. Okay, hold on. Let's do that again. So what I had to do, and this is a good lesson, instead of killing him with a knife, just punch him. And immediately dropping down again. I don't think anybody was watching him. Good. Yes, so we can kill him. <gasps> and now, now we can go and kill this guy as well. Not necessary, but if you sound an alarm, his uh, comrades, if they find him, they will free him. So it is best that you uh, kill anybody you come across. You lose some bonus merits, I think, way, if you kill instead of incapacitated enemies at the end. That's not too important for me, though. Okay. I want to show you guys all the side objectives in this mission as well, but yes. I don't really care about uh, these kinds of bonuses, you know, not killing, incapacitating if, <sighs> instead of killing. All right, now we need to go upstairs, obviously, to complete both the objectives, but in order to do that... Uh, sir, would you look this way? Thank you. Huh? Uh -huh. Now, can I knife him? Hold on, I'm gonna punch him just to be on the safe side. Then they might hear it if I use my knife. Right away, sir. <laughs> right, let's place him here, and now I can probably knife him. Good. <laughs> Pretty easily. Actually, let's put him in the corner. Oh, he might be visible there, though. No. Let's stick to this corner. Piece of cake. Now, I'm kind of curious. I could actually just bring him outside and place him here over the other body. We already know that's a safe position. All right, let's stick to the wall. And I'm gonna release that lieutenant. Yeah. I'm gonna let him walk a bit further away and then catch him again. We. Oui. Mm. All right. And now I think I can even knife him. He kind of looks far away from the other guy. Moin. All right. Kill both of them. Oh, actually, he managed to fire a shot. Interesting. I don't know if anybody heard that. Always ready. I don't think so. Alright, let's go up and see what's happening. Alright, now that you get there you can see our both uh both our objectives. There is a captain here inside this cell that we need to free. And more difficult than the other objective is in this room you have to retrieve something from this box. You have to operate this gate. This opens the gate so that the uh, U boat can leave. And you have an official in here, a, uh, an officer. We. Oui. Mm. 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 Huh? And now we can bring him up. 
Moin. Moin. Actually, let's stash him in the corner. Just to be on the safe side. And I think the officer has the keys. Yes, excellent. So we can rescue the captain as well. We. Oui. Thank God. I hope the Nazis didn't dismantle my submarine. Ah, you've stolen the Enigma machine. Now we must get the codes for it. They're in the next room. We must also destroy all the fuel deposits at once. Don't forget, we must destroy all the anti-aircraft guns too. Oh man, so you can see our objectives are uh, getting more in number by the second. I remember the first time I played this mission, I was actually quite uh, <laughs> quite annoyed at this guy. Like, I was almost done with the mission and suddenly we get to this guy and he says, yeah, you need to do that, you need to do that, you need to do, <laughs> like, destroy everything. Like, basically, we need to destroy the entire base with just a few commanders. <laughs> That's what this guy is saying. <laughs> 